Thank you so much, Ryan, for the William Byrd Terriers. They are 12 and one, and Saturday will be their first ever state semifinal appearance. Now, before the 2023 playoffs, Bird had only four playoff wins, and this playoff series alone, they have three. Now for the William Byrd Terriers, going from 0 and 9 in 2021 to the state semifinals in two years, it's been a hard and long road based on one factor: teamwork. Yeah, we don't really have any superstars on our team. We've got some good football players. Uh, but we have a really good unit and a good foundation within our locker room of kids that believe in each other. And right now, the great thing about this is everyone's helping us win. We believe in ourselves, and I mean, that's the reason we're here. So to see all the work that you've done and um, put down come and be rewarding, it means a lot. The William Byrd Terriers are the poster boys for teamwork and complimentary football especially when it comes to defense. In their 13 games this season, they've given up an average of 11 points per game, including three shutouts. They know they'll have to carry that spirit on to Saturday's game against a dominant, undefeated LCA team, as the Bulldogs are 12-0 on the year, scoring 46 points per game while giving up only eight points per contest with three shutouts. They're talented all around. We just got to... Um, game plan well against them. I mean, they have a lot of different athletes that can make plays. We got to make sure we can stop them defensively and score offensively. It's, it's going to take our best game. And I, and I think it, it's, their coach would say the same thing about playing us. Uh, it's a state semifinal game. Everybody at this point is really good. They have a really, really good football team, a lot of talent. Um, but I'm excited as, as one of the coaches in this football program to watch our kids play on that stage. I think they're really excited about it. Um, you know, we've shut out a lot, you know, a lot of the outside noise about, you know, the things that come with playing LCA. They're a really good team, and they've been in this game before. This is, this is new territory for our kids. But uh, they understand how big the moment is, but they also understand it's, it's four quarters of football. Now, the winner of the Bird LCA game gets the winner of Lafayette Brinsville District in a Class 3 final next Saturday. That'll be 5 o'clock from Williams Stadium in Lynchburg. Coming up.